Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back Open to Lego 2K Company. Drive. As you can see, we are back here in Big Butte County where we need to help Dr. Fastro, locate Dr. Fastro and help her with, did she say rockets? I guess we'll find out here in just a moment. I'm just running through the whole crowd, I'm sorry. Let's get over here though and we're just out here in the wild, wild west now. Jump over like that because if we do this, I think we'll unlock our last flag mission so that we can do the Big Butte County Grand Prix, which will be pretty cool. One of the important things we need to do in the game. So let's just rush over here. Oh no, come on, got it. <laughs> let's I check it out. Here. Watch out for the road rockets. I'm trying my best. Oh, we get a level up from all that too. We're level eight. Good to see it, good to see it. So what do we do now? Can I talk to you? There you are, help, my rockets have gone haywire. Retrieve them now and I'll let you use my newest chip pack invention. What do you say? Sure, wise decision. Now catch the rockets and bring them back here. Grab the haywire rockets and return them to Dr. Fastro. So I see a couple of them sort of flying around. Uh, there's one, so I guess I'll just grab that. Once I pick it up, return the rocket to Dr. Fastro. How do I do that? This thing is sort of propelling me forward. Whoa, this is hard to control. Come on, we're almost there, almost there. Boom, I got it. So there's one, I think I just hit Dr. Faster, I'm sorry. Uh, and then there's another one right over here. So to get that, I might wanna go over this way and then turn around. Use Come the on. quick turn button to turn quicker. I, I know. Come on, just a little bit more like this. Uh, it's so hard to control. These rockets really fight you, but we got it, we got it. All right then, so where's the next one? It is just zooming around over here. So if I could just jump for it and then maybe land on it. Ah, not quite, not quite. Gotta get over this way. Here's another one now. Here, ready? Jump, got it. This one's definitely gonna boost this run. Can I get more than one at once? I don't think I'm gonna be able to find out at the moment. Come on, come on. Uh, right here. Yeah, okay, got it, I got it. And then there's another Jump one right over this way. Rockets in the air. I'm trying. Ooh, I think that one's gonna loop around. So let's just, oh man, I am flying all over the place right now. Right here is where I should wait. And then once it's, oh, I missed it. <laughs> okay, we'll do this. Wait for it like this and then, gotcha. Very cool, so this will be rocket four out of six. I mean, luckily this isn't, ah, I timed it all. Darn, I lost a rocket that way. So hopefully it'll pop back up. Um, yep, here it comes again. So once again, we'll wait over here. We gotta make sure we're not running into anything then. Ah, oh, you're kidding me. Let's go right here and gotcha. Now I can go up to uh, Dr. Fastro. Get over that way, come on, we can do it, we can do it. We did it, we did it. Okay, so over here, another rocket's coming in. I think I'll need to find myself up about there. Wait for it. Here it comes, jump, got it. Now it's starting to kick in, but that's okay because we can just make our way over like that. One more rocket left and it's waiting over here. Come on, we can get this one no problem. Turn around really quickly, this is the last one. So let's just get it done super quick. This is cool though. I like this mission so far, but we're almost done with it. There it is. You got them all, what a relief. I give you permission to use my jetpacks all across Big Butte County. Have fun, whatever that is. <laughs> I will definitely have fun with the Big Butte County jetpacks unlocked. Wow, and we get the new perk bubble up. And of course, our prize is here. Now, before we go on to too much more, I do want to change it for loadout. Work. As a token of my thanks, I have unlocked all the jetpacks in Big Butte. Now go, fly away. So, how do the jetpacks work? Did you Whoa. hear that? You can use jetpacks. Jetpacks. Even I'm a little jealous. It does sound like fun. Okay, so with extra rewards coming in. I don't know what more we need to do right now, but like I said, I wanna take a look at our loadout. I wanna change our loadout a little bit each episode, and this time, let's try the awesome pizza vehicle. Look at this thing, really cool. So I'm gonna grab that. Um, when it comes to our off-road vehicle, I'm thinking we've done these two. Let's try the big old tax that we got unlocked last episode. Can I? Did that work? I think it worked. Yeah, okay. Um, and then, of course, for our boat, we have the Lake Cruiser we did on the first episode. Let's try the Royal Sailor. Wow, I do like that one. And then, of course, our character. We have Autopilot right now. Let's go over to Betty Boost. So, our characters are all updated. The, next race, the Abduction 500. That's Ooh. the last race you need to win before the Big Butte Grand Brick Arena. Let's go, Hotshot. All right, so we'll do that in just a moment. Oh, we also got Hugh Man. Oh, there was another rainbow brick up there, but I sort of messed it. But we'll keep that in mind for later. I think for right now, where's this last race at? Is this it? 
The Abduction 500. Sure, let's give it a try. So to do that, we need to get over here. Be human in the Abduction 500. It's not too far off. We just need to ride our boat down this way. Uh, oh, I'm doing this mission, I guess. Uh, let's abandon that, because I'll do that some other time. Yeah, right over by this big spaceship, right? That's what we gotta get to. I like this one a lot. <laughs> but no, wait. Is human. I guess so. Uh, hi, hey, human. Hey, there they are. I am human. What is up? Not much. I am from here and have been out hanging, breathing air, and disliking Mondays. Let's continue acting normal and race. Sure thing. <laughs> Definitely nothing odd about human. Uh, and he's our new rival, of course. So let's try this out. The abduction 500. Dodge the UFO lasers. All right, if you say so, that's what we'll do. <laughs> Just a friendly, earthly human taking some selfies. Human, eat my space dust. My EMPs are twice as shocking. We have a lot of spectators in the sky here at Abduction 500. Get ready, racers. They are putting on quite the laser light show. I also can't help but notice that there are several secret agents racing tonight. Hmm, you're right, Parker. <gasps> oh, maybe it's because this race is really a sting. Oh. And maybe they're trying to get more intelligence on one of the racers. Oh, because maybe they think the racer is not who he says he is. Oh, because maybe who he really is is an alien. Ooh. Keep watching ANN for more on this breaking story. I think they've pieced it together quite well. Whoa, look at the UFO car. All right, we gotta catch up the human here. It's really an alien. Superstar. So we're a little bit far behind at the moment, but we'll get some boost and just really start to move. You were on the pizza car too, which I love so much. Ooh, a power up. All right, let's launch some of that over. Ooh, this is this is great. Got it, got it, got it. Power up is ready. And oh, already we're hitting some enemies. Your boost is full. With quite a lot of stuff here. I can use an EMP there as well to knock some of them back, but if we have the lead, let's just try to keep it as we go into our boat here, which will make us much, much faster. This thing really knows how to zoom. Okay, watch out for the mines on the field. Oh no, I jumped over the power up. That's not really what I wanted. Hold the wheel at oh man, the UFO Yikes. trying to get us. They're really starting to catch up. Now, Human is taking the lead. We don't want that too much. So let's try going over here, I guess. Was this a good idea? I feel like I'm really far off now. Uh, ooh, yeah, really hard to do anything I'm with that. But we can go into firework mode lights. and hit a couple of enemies. Speed boost up here, but I get hit by the I spider web. Return. Come on, come on. You're making great time. You just gotta keep that going. If they get close to me, yeah, I can hit them with Wonderful. this. Losing is alien to me. Oh no, everybody's got such good puns. We're throwing the spider web behind us. Didn't quite grab anybody with it, but it could have. Oh wait, you get back here. Annoyed Couldn't quite I hit am. them. All right, I'm jumping over here. This seems like a bit of a shortcut, doesn't it? Beat it up, really going off road now. And a huge jump over here. Oh my goodness, we're getting some major air time with that. And we're coming up on the end. This one's not like a normal race where it's like we have to earn through a percentage. Good. Oh no, I'm stuck. I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Oh no, wait, I'm almost there though. Come on, Damn no! I got hit by a missile. That's the finish line. No, it's not, no, it's not. Okay, I got a little bit more. I don't know if we'll be able to get there in time. It looks like we lost, we got third. I didn't realize all the tall grass was there. That stinks. So that's our first time not getting first. Ugh. I mean, it's okay. It's just not what we needed. Rival beaten though. Hugh, man, we were still able to get them somehow. Yeah, well, what place did Human get? Fifth place? Really didn't turn out well for either of us, did it? I mean, hey, I'll take it. It moves the story forward, so that's at least good. All right, we get 17 brick bucks and 75 experience for it. Was that enough, though? I have I allowed need to... some beings to complete the path in advance of my vehicle. They seem pleased. So yeah, while we were able to do it, we didn't get the flag because we didn't get first Noted. place. So I think we're just gonna try it again Our really fast. Friend keeps looking at us. All right, let's try it again. See, now One, I know a bit better to jump legit. over that stuff. Really gotta look out for it, but it's so hard to notice. But that done, we'll get a first place finish for real this time. Stunning victory with the pizza truck and oh, somebody thrown it into me. Awesome. So there we go, we actually get the first place and we want a flag for it. And we unlock the off-road nebula climber. And of course, we beat Human again. Pretty cool. 
So now we're heading back over here to Big Butte where we'll have enough flags to take on the actual Grand Prix. Uh, that ought to be good. Here we go, getting a lot more rewards for it this time too. I can't win if I can't drive my own vehicle. It's in the shop. That's what they're calling it, but it's actually a hanger. Ooh, okay. According to local customs, this final checkered flag grants you permission to race in the first Grand Brick Arena. This is exciting. My many, 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 many followers are also excited. Woo-hoo, I say, woo-hoo. All right, so our we first Grand Brick Arena. Man. I wish they could have let him compete in his flying saucer. We'd lose, but boy, that would be something. These secrets have been kept poorly. Ah, oh, it was never a secret. People just get bored and lose interest. I guess so. Can we talk Greetings, to human again? Hi. Can can't you see that I'm busy? Okay, sorry. And then this guy's Hold also on, busy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have eight checkered flags. That means we can race in the Big Butte Grand Brick Arena. I'm so excited I can short circuit. Deep breath, stud. Good. Now. Show us the way, because I'm so freaking excited! All right, here we go, new rival popping up, guy number one. Oh, we're using some of the jetpacks here. Oh, this is so cool! Look at us go! Big Beat Arena. Hello, or Big it's Be me, everyone's hero, oh, no. Shadow Z. Listen, as much as I want to witness you lose the Big Butte Grand Brick Arena today, I can't. Is he, are you busy? I have jury duty, <laughs> and I need to focus on my civic responsibility of being fair and impartial. All right, have fun so with that. I've decided to let one of my squad members race for me. His name is guy number one, and watch out, because he's neither fair nor impartial. Uh-oh. So I guess we'll be racing guy number one as we go to the Big Butte Grand Brick Arena. Win your first medal in the Big Butte Grand Brick Arena. That's exactly what we'll try to focus on. So where is it? Way over here. So if we quick travel, we'll, we'll make that on our marker. Quick travel to this one and just start heading over there. So you're not gonna race Shadow Z this time. That's all right. Gotta go this way? Yeah, it seems like it. All right, well, should be a lot of fun. We gotta race through all these people, sorry. We haven't really been over this way too much, so maybe there's some extra things we can discover too, but you know, this is what we've been trying to work up to. All right, I'll get over like this. Only a few hundred meters to go. Wow, look at this, this is the Grand Brick Arena. It looks so cool. It's a huge stadium, like basically. Shadow Z says he's never wrong, but he also said you wouldn't make it to the Big Butte Grand Brick Arena, so I'm confused. <laughs> All right, we'll see what we can do with you. Uh, Grand Brick Arena official. Welcome to the Big Boot Grand Brick Arena. Eager racers like yourself compete here to win an official patent pending Grand Brick Arena medal. Isn't it shiny? Looks like you have enough flags, so come in and try So come and try and win um, a, this beauty for yourself. Cool. But, can I talk Hello. to you over here? Hi. Hi, as a member of the Shadow Squad, I would like to give you a crummy welcome to the Big B Grand Brick Arena and remind you that the, the, you stink. I was gonna say they seem nicer than Shadow Z, but over here we also find a collectible, our first of 15 silver sprockets around here in Big Butte. Big Butte Grand Brick Arena, here we go. This is gonna be great we're to be our rival. Um, if we can get first place, we get a lot of cool things too. So let's get going. Can we win in the Grand Brick Arena? It's the first Grand Brick Arena, and everyone in Big Butte County is here. I think I even saw Shadow Z. Uh, but Parker, Shadow Z DM'd everyone and said he has jury duty. Maybe he was dismissed early for badgering the witness and everyone else. <laughs> well, I'll tell you who is here. Some of our favorite rivals. Will Smuggle and Sally steal the win? Will Rusty Nuggets get the gold? Will Chip Hauser cry out for his mommy? Vicky, let's race and find out. Okay, whoa, this is guy number one looking pretty furious. Hammer down. All right, so we're getting started with our first big race here. This is so cool too, it's nighttime. The atmosphere is way different, way more intense. We're gonna have to pull out all of our racing skills if we wanna win this Ooh, one. A power up. We do have three laps we need to get through. We hit Smuggle and Sally, so we're racing some of the rivals that we saw in our way up here that we had to defeat to get these flags. Well, so that's a pretty cool sort of callback in that way. Um, 
Let's see, let's see. I guess that makes up all the racers that we're going against here. That's such a cool idea, actually. We're currently in fourth place, which isn't so bad. We're hitting all these cones, which definitely helps us with our boosts a little bit, but guy number one is still way in the lead. Come on. I'm trying to get to a spot where I can use these, but I might just want to throw them backwards, and I was able to hit Rusty with them. Sorry, Rusty. And I might have to hit max speed here with that one, but I don't think it actually hit them. Come on, come on. Huge drift going on, but it's still not enough to quite catch up. These, get, these racers are really tough so far. Whoa, the shark popping up. That was scary. I'm drifting like crazy over here, get quite the speed boost out of it, and then if I can pick up these red missiles, these are the auto-seeking ones, so I can get rid of guy number one. You're there we go. A lot of damage. Gears and sprockets. Come on, we are really in the middle of it now. I tried to hit guy number one with those missiles, but didn't quite work out. Ooh. You know, it might be a good idea. Oh, as we go, start to go really slow here. There we go, I get a full speed boost with that. We're in lap two now, so. We can keep going, we can keep going. If I can just get a little bit closer to these guys, I can maybe hit them with the EMP. I don't know if that actually got them. It doesn't seem like it did. Oh, but that hit guy number one, throwing those missiles behind me was a cool move. Watch out for the UFOs. They are all over the place. Oh, now I'm gonna go straight into that one, and luckily it didn't hurt me too much. Q-Man now catching up. Trying to take the lead from us, not on my watch, buddy. Oh, just barely made my way out of that. For now, we're trying to take it, but they are really fighting us on on this. They hit the shark, though. We didn't. Hey, now you're in front. Come on, don't you dare, don't you dare. I mean, push around here, but I can just go into ghost mode. That'll keep us nice and protected. Final lap. Final lap is pretty intense, but if I jump like this, did that count? That did count. I was a little bit worried that wouldn't count for a checkpoint. Oh no. Oh, no. oh I hit. Somebody, no, somebody hit me? Okay, I'm just throwing a little bit of everything out right now, but we are starting to take the lead a little bit more as we head into this last lap, or continue through it. And that's good. I need to hit more of these cones. I'm trying what to EMP people. I don't know, guy number one. As long as you're happy, I hope you're happy. Okay, go a little bit closer. Throw out the spider web somewhere because we are starting to build up a bit of a lead, but one small mistake could send us crashing back down to the farther places, as you can see, Ooh, because these guys will not let up. Oh, you went into ghost mode at that exact moment. Oh, geez, I'm a little scared here, but what we can do is hit you with a missile, maybe. Oh, we all got hit by the fireworks, I think. How, what do I do? I don't know. Okay, I think this is gonna be, Alert. no, I got smacked. That is so unfortunate. We're coming up on the last little bit here. I really need to move. Ah, oh, geez, that is so unfair. How did that not stop him? I just thought that was some really, really bad luck. There's nothing more I can do. We get a third place finish. Darn. I don't know what I could have done to really protect myself from that, but uh, right now, guy number one beat us. We're gonna try again now. Because <laughs> guy was tough, but definitely not unbeatable. We got really, really close there. What will you say now, though? Do we get another try? Was it like one try and that's it? I'm not sure. Uh, no, I think I can just run back in, give it another try. Okay, we are pretty close to winning this, but everybody is on top of each other. I don't know if we'll get it. It's super duper close. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, just barely. He was right on top of the Big Butte Champion Trophy earned. That was a lot better. Oh, man. Look at this. We get ourselves a big gold trophy for sure. You won a medal. That's awesome, and we get our new perk, the Melee Boost, as well as an electronic sports car, which of course is a street car. And we have beaten a rival, guy number one. Man, not easy at all, but we found a way to come on top. Whoa. Well, how do you like that, Parker? A victory no one predicted. I like it just fine. Thanks for asking. Don't mention it, Parker. Well, too late. I already did. <laughs> <laughs> We're in music. <laughs> I knew this rookie was going to be trouble. Yeah, probably cheating and not getting caught. Just like us. Exactly. All right, guy number two, you're up next. This should be easy. Just go really fast, don't crash, and don't lose like guy number one. Got it? Jeff. I'm <laughs> sorry, what? My name's Jeff. Oh, yes, of course, of course. We're all special individuals here and should be treated with an equal amount of respect. Not just assigned some random number based on the order in which you were hired. So, from now on, I'll be sure to go out of my way 
to make an exclusive effort to call you... Name? G guy number two? Great! Love it! Guy number two! Now don't lose! Alright, so I guess our next guy to race will be Jeff. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. I <laughs> think he's gonna hold a grudge about that one. This Shadow Z, not a very nice person, it seems. But we're gonna have to race through all of his henchmen if we wanna be able to defeat him. Looks like we got a lot of extra rewards, too. Awesome. Congratulations! I'm your local representative for the Bricklandia Racing Federation and would like to award you with your first Grand Brick Arena medal. Win two more and you'll qualify for the Sky Cup Grand Prix. You've got a ways to go, but I can tell that you'll do great. Ooh, so there it is. I don't know who you think you are, but this is my race and you can't just roll in with no skill or experience and beat me. Who sent you? I want a name. That was incredible! When you did this, and everyone was like, whoa! And then you drifted like, and boom! You slotted into first, and you should have heard the crowd! Take a victory lap, Hotshot. While you do, earn Class B. You'll need it for what's next. Okay, so they really mean we want to race again? Find on-the-go events, quests, and challenges to gain XP and get to level 10. That is so cool. So I figure we'll hang around here in Big Buchanan County to get level 10. We're not even 7% through this area, which is pretty crazy. So uh, that is still great. It looks like we'll have to get to level 16 if we want to unlock the Grand Prix race over for, uh, what was it called? Um, whatever this area is called, um, Perspective Valley. So we won't worry about that for now. Things like Coffee Caper is a quest if we wanted to do that, but maybe we'll just focus on on-the-go events like this one over here. Uh, seems like a plan. Dude, this game is so much fun. I'm really having a blast with it. There's some extra stuff over here too. Like what is this? This is a, a world challenge. Over here, I'm pretty sure yeah, this is a no on the go event. Air pin turns. Let's talk to you. Practicing on the open road is a great way to warm up for the big races. For this challenge, drive through the checkpoints around the airport before the time runs out. Okay, I'll give it a try. Which way do I go with this one? Just like this. Over here, come on, go, go, go. I think I'll have to do yeah, like a big drift. I'm stuck in this stuff. Once again, it's so hard to notice because I'm trying to focus on driving forward. I don't notice what's directly in front of me. I'm trying to look out for the turns and different ways to maneuver, so that could be a little crazy. That's definitely gonna eat into our time. We might have to try this one again if we want a better time than bronze. That's okay. And there we go. Let's restart the event one more time to see if we can at least get silver. Oh no, <laughs> not the way I wanted to go. Didn't start at the best angle. And then get over that stuff. There we go, much better, much better. Definitely gonna get a better time as it currently stands. Ooh. I don't think we'll quite get a gold medal, especially when I miss that, oh my goodness. Wait, was that it? <laughs> okay, we got one of it done. I, I, I guess we'll leave the other one. Uh, let's see what else we can do around here. Uh, there's a couple more of these. So let's try Minefield Mayhem. So we're trying to get the level 10. We're at level nine right now. So we're getting a lot closer with each one. I'd like to get over this way. Dodge all that stuff. And just for like running around and exploring stuff, we're getting experience too. But take, take a look at this one. Waypoint reach, hold on. Abandon the mission so that I can actually check out what I'm supposed to do. Is there anybody to talk to? There is. So I wanna talk to them. Hi. Oh, sorry, I knocked you over. Blustering Blaine. Those crazy pilots are throwing mines all over the place. Think you can still complete three laps? I'll try my best. So we need to do it in one minute. All right, I'm getting to it, I'm trying to turn. There it is, there it is. Oh, these mines are really all over the place. Whoa! Okay, come on. Nah, you gotta be kidding me. It's very easy to sort of fly off in a direction I don't wanna go. Wow, uh, this is a mess. Where am I going? I'm going over here. I'm supposed to be going faster than this, I'm sure. I think we can put in our first lap, but it's really hard to tell. So far, I don't think we'll be getting a gold medal. Come on, <laughs> I'm trying to stop, and but it will not stop. It's crazy. There it is, there it is. Jeez, this is ridiculous. Uh, going over here, making these maneuvers is really challenging. Those mines are exploding though, which is good. I'll turn like this and go through that. Got it, got it. Getting a little bit more used to it as we go along, but it's not always easy like that one right there. Uh, but I still got through the checkpoint with that, which is nice. Don't run into the house. Excuse me, sorry. 
And there we go, I did not get enough score to really do anything. That's a little upsetting, it's just, it's so difficult. But maybe if we get a stronger start with it. There we go, come on, come on. Jump and turn, because I need to beat one minute, at the least, if we want to get a reward here. I can certainly do that, right? I would think so, but now I'm not even moving. That's lap number one done pretty quickly. Got it. Got to turn in place and then try not to, oh man, it's fine. Actually could have been a lot worse there for sure. So we do that, we turn in place, I back it up a little bit maybe. It's just one of those things where the, the momentum to the cars could be definitely something to get used to. Even when you try to stop, you never stop on like a dime. I guess as they say. Ah, come on, come on, get back up please. Takes a while once you fall over like that. We only have 10 seconds to complete this race. Are you kidding me? Why are you launching me onto the moon? Ah, I don't know if we'll be able to do it in time, but I'm really gonna try. Right there, and then right over here, two seconds left. I just did it with one second remaining. I'll take it. That one was a little frustrating. I'm sure if we get a car with more health though. We got 100 experience for it though. What else can we do? There's another on the go event over here. So I might as well try to focus on that one. It's not too far off anyway, so we'll get over here and other side of town, I think. Oh, we found another, oh, I guess we ran into a golden trophy. I didn't even see it. <laughs> and we get sidewalk hog, trophy earned. I guess we're being on the sidewalk. Uh, Yeah, here it is. Hey there, wise guy. Think you have the skills and restraint to beat my test? Drive carefully. You get 0.5 seconds against your time for every object you crash into. All right. So we gotta go this way. I don't see any objects around here. So just gonna drive really careful. No, none of the things in the sidewalk or anything. I don't know if the cars count. They probably do. It looked like they did, so we just gotta be really careful to drive on the right side of the road. Don't wanna go too fast. I found another discovery though, which is nice. Okay, you guys are in the way. That is definitely adding a lot to my time. But I go through here like this. Don't hit the pole, no! Ah, oh, geez, I'm already back. To, um, I'm already like way down the silver. Go through here like this. That isn't so bad. And here's the finish line. So we're able to at least get a bronze medal and with it, some nice little goodies. Not quite level 10 yet. Oh no, maybe, maybe, let's see. That'll add our extra total. We'll be at 672. So I still need to look around at least a little bit more. Um, maybe, oh, down here, speed run. I didn't see this one. So we'll get that done. Over here, ah, no, sorry. Uh, welcome to Big Butte, the safest county there is. Five police officers to every citizen. Oh my. Uh, yeah, that's the police officer building. Oh, there's another collectible. What if I get this? This might be enough. So this is another trophy. Thank you. Nice. That was some good experience for sure, but not quite everything we need. So this is so many people to talk to. Making coffee, my daily grind. All right, over here, I think it was. Oh, way up there. Some might be a little bit difficult to get to. We'll find a way though. I guess I have to go up this way. We've already done that one mission. We can get up here instead. Just like that, perfect. Is there anybody to talk to for this one? Run through the, oh yeah, I see them. Uh, give me your ear a moment, racer. Enjoy a scenic crowd if you'd like, but make sure you don't try to clip the challenge short and miss a, the bridge heading out of town. Okay. So what exactly do I do? I guess I just go over there. Run through the course as fast as you can. No restrictions with this one, no mines falling on the floor or anything. I'm already running to the wall though, which is not so good. These challenges have been really tough so far. Okay, there we go. Boosting through town like that will definitely help. I'll jump over all this stuff over that. That was really, really cool. And I've noticed that even just drifting in place like that still gives us an extra boost. Uh, this is just the first checkpoint. Don't fall off the bridge. Come on, we got it. So that's another bronze medal for us. And I think enough for us to uh, maybe get Level 10? I think so. Yeah, we only need three more points. So yeah, this is perfect. Whoa, we are level one, or not 100, 10. <laughs> there we go, one zero. And we're in class B, so we're a class B racer now. New on the go event over there too. We're finding lots of cool stuff, but beyond that, let's see what our actual mission is now. Um, Well, we've already done that. Yeah, I don't know what we're supposed to do. Uh, Good question. Um, because there's a lot of like, you know, quests and stuff. Whoa, what did the game want me to do? Oh, here we go. Champ? This is big news. You earned enough XP to go from a class C racer to a class B racer. Starting now, the races are gonna be harder, but you're gonna be faster. And there's room for more cool stuff in your loadout. Not only that, 
You just unlocked Brick Bash! Now you can turn into a fireball of mass destruction and plow right through the competition! Whoa! Just fill your boost meter, press and hold the boost button, and whammo! You're Brick Bashing! I think it's time you and I had a rematch. I want to see first how you handle yourself on the track. And this time, I'm not driving a golf cart. The student meets his master on the battlefield once more. But this time, the master will not hold back. Will the student survive? Will the master be brought down by his own pupil? The classic conflict. Some might call it cliche, but I never tire of it. Stud and I have been watching a lot of kung fu movies in the garage. Uh, not sure if you can tell. All right, so return to clutch. Race clutch against again in turbo acres so i'll do that soon but as you can see i guess if i hold the speed boost down when i'm at a full boost i think that was it right there i don't really know exactly the thing we unlocked a little bit weird but we did of course get more things in our loadout now so what i can do is go to our perks and equip a second perk so things like um oh i don't have any uh that's weird i definitely have other perks maybe because they're all class c perks yeah, that's odd. Okay, so I guess I'll have to unlock some throughout our adventure. I guess each perk is sort of handled differently, but you can see our base stats have gone up. So we'll be going faster, we'll be handling things a lot better, which means older missions will probably be a lot easier now. So definitely worth returning to those at some point. Probably not right now though. With that being said, we're going through Carpal Tunnel right now. That's so silly. Um, I don't know if there's too much more I wanted to do in today's episode. I could quick travel down this way and explore a little bit more just to find different things. But I think in general, we've done a great job. Um, our general goal, if we, zoom, if we were to zoom out, we got Big Boot County, Perspective Valley. There's still one more area to discover, but here's Turbo Acres. I don't want to race, um, what was his name, Clutch, just yet, but it might be fun to do some things here, like Hubcap Hill Climb or something. So I'll mark that on our map. We'll do a couple of those and then wrap it up for today. All right, so here we are. It wants me to do all that. I'm gonna save it for later. I wanna do this over here. So let's see if we can get this on. So what is this one? Uh, it will talk to you really quickly. Let's see you get to the top of Hubcap Hill. Remember, tr remember to jump over the mines. Okay, I can do it like this. Just gotta be very careful because ah, uh, they're all over the place. Gotta turn. Ah, uh, just barely missing these ones. Uh, okay, keep jumping, keep jumping. That counted, that's good. Oh, close. Almost there, almost there. No, wait, don't fall off. Are you kidding me? That is so unfair. Definitely some cars do not have the best handling, so I just gotta be ready for that. But it's okay, we'll just try again. Oh, I got hit by that one. Gotta restart, I think. I guess I didn't have to, but it really slowed me down, so. I'd like to just get a good run going on here. I almost got hit by that one. This game is pretty challenging so far. Okay, gotta jump over that stuff. We're almost to the tippity top here. If I jump over like that, we got it. We get a gold medal for it too. Awesome, our first gold medal in the game, I think. And because of that, we get plenty of rewards. That's nice. Uh, what else can we do around here? It looks like that's it for all of those like um, on the go events. Maybe I could try one of these uh, Drift Acres kind of uh, world challenges. I mean, I guess I've maybe done this one before. It says my best. But some of them I haven't, so. Yeah, they're a little bit weird. I guess there is only one more I can do here, which is tea time. It would be cool to complete more of these, though, um, because it doesn't seem like there's really too much more to do with them. Um, all right, so where's way over that way? So we'll do this. This will be the last one of these uh, world challenges we can do in this area. Yeah, I think that's the new mode we unlocked, is when we sort of go into hyperdrive there, so that's pretty cool. Are there any collectibles to find in this area? Spotless wrenches, turbo acres bucks, and turbo acres weeds. I guess I've just heard one of the weeds, but there's 50 of them in total. Seems a bit odd. Look at this colorful house, so I love it. Hi. hi. Wait, I want to say hi to you. Uh, get these golf balls down the hill and into the cup. It can be tricky, so use quick turn for better handling. This one is story mode. Rush, push all the golf balls into the hole, drive slowly for more control, and use square to turn quickly. This seems like a lot of fun. Um, Sure. All right. Sink all the balls into the hole. This is a really cool mission. So I got this golf ball right here. What I can do is just push it down the hill and hopefully it'll make its way in. Maybe while that one's doing its thing, we can work on a different one. And then once they're actually all near the hole, we can sort of work on getting them in together. But they might roll a little too far. I'm not quite sure how that's gonna work. 
Okay, we got one of them, two of them. See, uh, they just sort of keep getting closer. Awesome, so this is sort of the last one, so we can guide this one a little bit more. I think that's the most time efficient thing we can do, though. Awesome, so in the hole, there we go. No, wait, come on, come on. No, no, don't go that way. Ooh, it might just be better to let it do its own thing, but even then, it was so close to getting in before, but it didn't quite make it. Come on, that's it, right? A little bit more? Come on, don't do this to me. It's more difficult than real life golf. There we go, we finished tea time. That was actually a pretty quick mission then. Weird that that's a part of story mode in that way, but that does mean that we got all four of the world challenges done in this area. That's great. So obviously there's a lot more left to do in the game and we're getting farther and farther in it with each challenge that we complete. But we'll have to work more on that, I think, in the next episode of LEGO 2K Drive. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.